I have absolutely no idea if I'm going to get flagged for a copyright violation because they are jamming in the back room and it's good vibes. It's like old school Motown, old classic rock, really good beat today. Um, we go all over the place. We listen to classical music here. We listen to gaming music here, country, rap, hip hop, rock, thrash, metal, Pantera is real big here. Um, that's usually me in the shop. But we just, we're all over the place. So House of the Rising Sun is on in the background, if you guys can hear that. Sorry. Hey, everybody. Jen Kravasi, Jekyll Bates, and this is your workshop update. So lots to show off today. Good show and tell session for you guys. I am currently uploading to YouTube a... Um, a session on that which we'll show you in just a bit there's a ton of stuff on my desk some of it is done a lot of it's going out the door i've got some crank baits i've got swim baits i've done a few drops on my website which is a little bit different you guys are probably if you're bullshad crowd you're used to mike and tyler dropping it on their website at bullshad.com and you guys can still benefit from those drops they're doing trick shad uh like, you won't know unless you're on the newsletter, and then they'll announce the uh, actual drop usually like 30 minutes ahead of time. So if you guys want to be the first to know about any of their drops on the website, be sure to subscribe. You just go to bullshad.com, click on that news uh, newsletter icon, and make sure you subscribe to the newsletter. You will be the first to get all the goods and the deets on when their drops are happening and going down. Today, I'm going to show you a few things, this being the first piece that I'm going to show you guys. This is a new and improved version of my mirror carp, and I've done lots of upgrades to it. This is, and I'm hand-holding today, I really just kind of felt like walking around and talking and stuff, so we're probably going to move around a little bit. Um, this is a, a little bit different. There's a lot more depth of color in here. There's a lot more... Um, I think real, realism, a lot of times you guys, um, I've been known for doing like cartoonish type stuff and illustrative per, uh, stuff on the, on the baits, but I wanted to kind of get a little bit more realistic with the scaling. So you can see that there's several different hues and tones and shades inside of that. And if you guys are interested in learning about how I do process with my baits, you can see what I put together on a regular basis. And you can see um, all kinds of stuff in spray sessions on the YouTube channel. So if you guys are new to the channel, if you're not subscribed, smash that like button if you like what you're hearing and seeing. And um, you get to see Mike mailing things and shipping things because that's what he does. He's doing Mike things today, which is pretty cool. So um, it's fun to hang out in the shop with him. He doesn't always come in anymore, Gary Dobbins. And... It's fun. It's just, it's it's a really good Tuesday in the shop, and we're all just kind of hanging out and jamming, and Mike looks like he's going back and forth with some stuff, and there's Chris, so everybody's... <laughs> I know he wanted to say something to me, but he just didn't. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is, this is a continual shot. So there's that. This is a 9-inch glide. And from time to time, they do custom drops on this. This stuff you guys have seen before, I'm not going to focus on it this this time. A couple of trick shads up here, a couple of different pieces that are still on the website. So Jekyll Bates, my website, JekyllBates.com. Look for a summer drop. I think it's summer drop one, maybe. Um, that's the page where you're going to find the swim baits at right now, currently. And this is what I have going out the door. Uh, I've got some real pretty... 4x4, four four, as you can tell, a 4x4 four four from awake because of the widened flare at the bottom of the lip and the angle that it digs in. This is like a great big old crankbait, y'all. Fantastic summer bait. Big bait, big fish. I believe it because I've seen it happen. And the, the more I fish these things, the bigger fish that I've been catching. So huge believer in swim baits. It just works. There's You don't need me to tell you. There's a million people out there that are in the game right now that had not been before because this actually does catch the biggest bag of your life. When you dedicate the time to it, it gives back in tenfold. This is an OG Smoothie 6-inch rat, and this is in the Bloody Muskrat pattern. So we've got that going on today. And we've got these beautiful, bright, bubblegum pink Danny Joe's original floating worm. We recommend the floating worms. Yes, you can use a salt-loaded worm. 
The taste might be better for the fish to hang on to, but if they're hitting the tail, it's a short bite anyways. Um, and the floating worm is going to make this thing swim much better than a tail that's loaded with salt and hanging down off the bottom of this as you're trying to move it through the water. So Danny Joe's, that's from Catch Outdoors, Kelly Barefoot's company. So make sure you guys pick up a pack today. We do sell replacement tails. We sell glow-in-the-dark tails. There's all kinds of cool stuff from Danny Joe's that we can provide you on the Bullshad website. But there's a couple of those. This is uh, also a client repaint in a really cool ice blue crappy pattern. And this is on that six inch gill swimmer, just a regular bull gill. I've got a foghorn with a little bit of purple on the nose. Just did a bunch of foghorns that we're going to get into here. Actually, they're right there um, for a client, and I kind of wanted to throw. I had a few of these in my bag. I get painter's baits from these guys, and uh, it's a wonderful opportunity to have some fun and get creative and do some patterns for you guys and drop them on my website. And then we've got this Byron Childers Shad. And uh, the reason I'm saying that, if you guys missed the trick shad drop that Missile Baits did with John Cruz and Byron Childers, Byron and I uh, put together the pattern on this, and uh, it's smoking, man. It's it's a really cool, beautiful purple. And we did these on trick shads and nine-inch glides for the missile baits drop that they did. And uh, it's just such an ass-kicking pattern. I had to put them on a couple of swimmers for you guys. So these are on the little guys, the five-inchers. They're also on the JekyllBaits.com website under the summer drop on that link. In the crankbait form, we've got some breeding 2.5s, square bill. These are hot off the presses. They're going to get cleaned up and sent out. We've got a bunch of different, the Little Johns in a breeding long, long ear. We also have those breeders in wakes, and you can tell, you can tell I just pulled these off the clear coat rack. Got a couple of 1.5s. These are usually some of the first to go. But love that iridescent purple in there with that gold, almost an antique gold, and that bright, bright, bright rust orange breast. We've also got these guys on the circuit board lip. These are great baits. A little bit different of a rattle than these guys. This is a single one tap but kick-ass pattern nonetheless really good for summer did a bunch of them for you in the uh in the gills also in the swim baits look at that that is some cool color shift blue into purple oh we're at the we're at the beach now and then you've got that kind of turquoise aqua down into gold into that traditional breeding color all the way back so i think i might have one or two of these left on the website they went relatively fast this is an eight inch glide in a modified byron childers shot pulled that yellow all the way through because it just kind of looks good against that purple almost a table rock color almost a table rock color got to get a tail on this after we clear coat it this one is not clear coated yet and going into these guys, we've got some bigs and some hyper shad. This is for client James Wolfenbarger. Now he sent me uh, several crankbaits. I've been kind of showing you guys what crankbaits he sent on uh, on my socials, on Instagram and Facebook. And then this is just that final look, the finished product. Is that foghorn just super slick beautiful shiny good looking bait and this is in the hyper shad so we did the foghorns in the hyper shad we did the bigs in this and i've got one more that's clear coating that he wanted uh, uh plastics pattern uh mimicked and he wanted glitter on that so i did a little bit different of a clear coat on that just to kind of brush on that groovy, almost like a Kytec flashy glitter he wanted in that. And then this, we just did a spray session. 
So this is getting ready to go out to him. And this, of course, is that classic, iconic loon pattern that Whopper Plopper has on their baits from river to sea. And just my take on it. On that hyper shad. So we got bigs, we got hyper shads, we got some bull shads, we got some bull rats. Lots of stuff that you guys have already seen up there. And that, folks, is all the news that is fit to print. I hope you've enjoyed this quick little update. We will show you a lot more coming down probably by the end of the week. So I hope you have a rest of your week that's fabulous, and I will see you on the next video. Cheers and happy casting from Jekyll Bates. Yeah.